warning! This video is extremely loud. It's because I'm using these goofy, uh, earbuds. Alright, I'm having the weirdest, like, weekend of all time. My lights just, like, just got, like, busted. Like, they don't work for some reason. Every time I plug them in, they're like, No, I don't want to work. And then, my headphones that I always use in my videos, whenever I plug in, I can't hear the sound. And the mic quality sounds like this. And when this one is through... And now I have to use these, but I can't hear any audio from it. Which, honestly, doesn't sound any better. So I'm having the jolly good weekend. Okay, so about, like, somewhere between June and July, I made the this video of, like, Hey, what if John Juniper actually survived? And I just scrapped the video, because I feel like my editing style is kind of hard to understand what like what i try to explain like my my adhd brain is so crazy it's like oh you want this now you want that now you want that. It's, it's so distracted and uh i showed it to a friend and he was like dude this is the funniest video that you've made and i'm like no that's stupid it was hard to it was like hard to understand he was like dude you need to post that you'll get like a billion riz and i was like a billion riz bleh. and uh now we are here the video you're about to see is uh was taken before i expected to die three but yeah uh anyway uh i'm a bad i'm bad at explaining things so enjoy this video because my friend said it was funny roll the clip Roll the <laughs> Greetings, agents. Welcome back to another long-awaited video on I Expect You to Die 3. So we're going to talk about one of the final theories that I have that I think is pretty true. John Juniper, he seems like a good guy. He's not. And, uh, he died at the end of I Expect You to Die 2. Spoiler alert. But, uh, I, I don't, I don't think so. I, I think he's, I think he's, I think he's still alive. It's important to remember one thing. You're wrong. Here's why. Reason one. In the website read all over, there's this, like, little card, um, that shows, like, the death and the funeral of John Juniper. And it shows when the funeral's happening at, like, this place in California or something like that. Picked a nice place to have his funeral in California. The land of Disney. By the way, it wasn't California. It was, like, Indiana or something. And it basically just shows a big description of where the funeral is happening, at what times and stuff. And if you read the card very closely, there's this one part that says it'll be happening in a closed casket performance. Now, closed casket. A closed casket is, a uh, Google, help me this out here. This means the body will not be displayed for the service and, in most cases, oh. will not be embalmed. It means that nobody can see the body because the casket is closed. So basically a closed casket. Now why would there need to be a closed casket? Why can't we, why can't we see the body? Well, yes and no. Sure, it may have seen he like he fell to his death, but there's no like giant thud at the ground, like boom, that he hit the ground. I mean, wouldn't there be if he fell 42, 32 floors to the ground? I don't know. Maybe it's a missed detail, but still. Also, the rocket hasn't really launched yet, so he could have possibly grabbed onto the rocket and kind of slid down to where there's like a little gate area like at the bottom of the rocket right here in this picture here's the rocket it's about to launch juniper falls Whee! there is a very like 50 50 chance that he could have just went on this ledge and backed up and i don't know maybe he slid down the rocket we also got this new character sam in accounting now i uh I don't really know what he's all about. Supposedly, he's like the ex-boyfriend of Sean in HR. Are we gonna meet him? And then he's gonna be all like, oh my god, Sean is like Asian. <laughs> oh my god, Sean at HR is just like so mean to me. And then like the ending is just gonna be like, oh my gosh, Agent, Agent Phoenix, you made me rethink about my boyfriend. Come here, you. Yeah. So this isn't this isn't really a theory video. I just wanted to point something out about John Juniper. He could still be alive. He could be impersonating our handler again. No. Maybe he could be impersonating Sam and Accounting. No. His description matches 
with John Juniper, just a little bit. No. He has different eyes, the kind of same hair color, but then again, that can all be changed. You can change your eyes. No. You can change your hair color. No. But, I don't know, it's just weird. They just add a new character, and they're like, oh, yeah, they're, uh, uh, yeah. Happy picture day. Oh, yeah, and happy birthday to Sam and Accounting. But you gotta think about it, though. Why would they have mentioned John Juniper's name, like, like four or five times? Like, just to, like, really, like, hey, he's dead, okay, guys? Now stop making furry fan art! Okay, uh, I think that's the end of the video. I don't think my theory is correct, but, like, believe what you want to believe. But, uh, what else is there to talk about? Um... Oh, yeah, my wish! Do you remember a while ago when I said it'd be cool if we got the soundtrack of the game in the car? And... Uh, on August 17th... I got it! So, uh... Thank, thanks, thanks, Shell Games. I think you're probably already gonna do that. Don't don't say yes. I, I want I want to think that you guys did it for me. I don't really know what else to talk about. I'm just trying to make this video longer so it can hit like more than the five minute mark. You know you know what? Let's have a conversation right now. So uh, how are you? Mm -hmm. Great. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay. Really? With your sister? What? Okay, that's it. Goodbye. Julian.